So they go to this university and, and it's so kind of under construction, the area, um, but it's really darn cool. And I uh, begrudgingly to Steph did like a live really quickly just to see what would happen. And this was the live right here. Um, I'm literally in the area that they are now building. This is at the University of Miami. And uh, this should be done in about, I think, six to eight weeks or something like that. There's Steph on the right, sorry, on the left. And this is the grand hall. This would fit 300 people with tables. So you could have conversations. So you could have your laptop out. So you could do normal stuff, not just be stuck in a tiny room. So we talked to the university and we toured the campus and I said, how is this gonna work? And this is what they told us. They said, you're gonna have your 300 person main event area. This is where the presentations are to kick off. These are where the big speakers are talking. This is where everything is en masse. Most conferences just keep it here. Fine, whatever. They bring out another speaker, they go into the front, they hoorah for an hour and a half. Another speaker, go to the front, hoorah for an hour and a half, fine. I didn't want that. I wanted you to hoorah and, and then say, all right, let's go do a webinar right now. Let's do a VSL right now. Let's do it at the beginnings of our book right now. Let's do the cold email right now, the voicemail drop right now. Let's have your whatever right now. And so as we talked to UM, we said, we're gonna need breakout rooms. Normal, no big deal, that's fine. They're building that, which is cool. So here could be a 30 person breakout, 30 person workshop. And then another 30 person workshop, again and again and again. So we'll have like a main speech in the 300 person area and it'll be a hoopla and hoorah for like 30, 45 minutes, break your brain, show you what's possible and say, all right guys, get to work. And then the main area is now closed. Go do your stuff. Here's somebody leading the workshop. Go learn from them. So here you could have ESLs. Here you could have sales manager. Here you could have a book person. Here you could have your content re-leverage program person. Here you could have CEO as a service person. Here you could have bots or landing pages or million dollar campaigns. Pick the one you want to do. Do it for an hour and a half, come back to the main area, another hoopla, hoorah, lunch, brunch, all that stuff. This is going to be ASCON. But we realized pretty quickly, this isn't a conference. We're all going back to school. This is Agency Scaling Secrets University. Right here. This is the format for the actual event. This is what is going to be moving somebody's needle in their business, specifically at the event. Not, oh my God, this is so exciting, go home and do work. Nope, you're not leaving with homework, you're getting it done now. There's a guy on stage talking about VSLs, you're gonna do VSLs, a guy on stage talking about sales manager, a girl on stage talking about book funnels, a girl on stage talking about the content relevance program again and again and again, and then you're gonna go and you're gonna do it with them. Yeah, I will be the first conference in my cohort's history of paying speakers so we can get damn good speakers.